Hey, Anna. You know, I've taken so many of these boat tours and learned so much about Chicago and its history, but seldom do I take a boat tour where the boat has plenty of history. This one is an old fire boat. One of the co-owners is Captain Ray Novak. Good morning. Good morning. Tell me a little bit about her. Well, you're on Fred Bussey, uh, engine 41, and uh, she was built in 1936, served from uh, 1937 and retired in 1981. I love that in here you've kept it kind of like a museum. Um, there's this one this I love the story of this this came from Soldier Field right? That came from Soldier Field yeah we uh, purchased that uh, from a person down in Kankakee uh, mm -hmm. that Can got that. Can you open it for me right yeah, now? Yeah absolutely uh -huh. it's really cool because mm -hmm. this is call box number nine and when you push the uh, button down it would send a signal out to another box it would say call box number nine was uh, pushed down there's something emergency that needs has happened over there. Let's take a uh, picture sure. let's take a look at some of the pictures that you sure. provided for us what kind of fires would she fight? So anything along the water that's mm -hmm. on the water. Uh, one of the big things was in the 60s, uh, she uh, was one of the three fireboats that supplied water to the McCormick Place. And yeah, because you could totally reach yep, it, yeah. The, the McCormick Place didn't have any water at the time. It was mm -hmm. all frozen. And uh, so we had to supply all the water to those uh, firemen on land. Where did you find her? She was uh, uh, up in Sturgeon Bay mm -hmm. and uh, for the last 20 years mm -hmm. and uh, the owners wanted to uh, retire and we got a chance to uh, get her down here. I think and, you're a Navy guy, right? Uh, yes, yes. And so is Eric, your yeah, co-owner. Yeah, we're both ex-Navy guys. What does this vessel mean to you? A lot, because uh, I was a boiler tech, so mm -hmm. this boat was the uh, turning point for the city because this is the first diesel power boat in the country, really, and for the city. She was built with a lower profile, okay. so you didn't have to go uh, have bridge lifts. Uh -huh. Before that, all the steamboats had all those big stacks, and you had to get all these bridge lifts done to go fight a fire. What kind of tours do you offer on So her? we do uh, the historical tours. Mm -hmm. We leave from our dock, we'll go on the lake, and we'll go down the, uh, the Chicago Locks and then down the river and we talk all about uh, what's happened in Chicago and the history uh, because this is a historical boat so that's what we talk about. We do talk about the architecture because yeah. It's the city of Chicago. It's absolutely gorgeous. It's changed since 1936. Yep. So we got to you know, give credit where credit's due. On where that. can people find information about reservations, yeah. tours, and so on? So we could go to our website at fireboattours.com. And on there, it gives uh, all the information on all our tours, our, our guided tours, our sunset cruises, our firework cruises. We also do live music events. Mm -hmm. And uh, every Thursday night, we teamed up with a company called Phase 3 Brewery. Mm -hmm. and which is a veteran owned as well and they come here and they actually uh, put beers on the boat for people to taste us before they even go in the market. I love it. Yeah. I love it like a preview. That's preview, great. Preview, yeah. Alright guys, when we come back around town we will continue working hard for you on a Friday. <sighs> this around town gig is really <laughs> exhausting.